New at 5, we're speaking with Kingsport City Schools about the impact food insecurity has on its students. 46% of Kingsport students are currently on a free or reduced lunch. School leaders tell us for some of them, it's their only meal of the day. News Channel 11's Katherine Simpson found out how they're using that knowledge to fight child hunger. At Jackson Elementary School, students line up for lunch for at least one in six and maybe even one in five. This might be the only meal they eat. A lot of what families do is they just skip meals or, you know, they don't give them, they don't have the money to feed them a healthy meal. Kingsport City Schools nutrition supervisor Jennifer Walker says the impact of those missed meals extends far beyond the weekend. We can tell how hungry kids are on Monday after a weekend. And Walker says it's not just the student's ability to focus on school that suffers. When children are food insecure, they're going to have higher risk for mental and physical issues such as diabetes, obesity, hypertension, anxiety, depression. The district does what it can to combat hunger, offering free meals to all students at qualifying elementary schools and by covering partial meal costs for some students. If you apply and you qualify for reduced benefits, um, you're not going to have to pay the 30 or 40 cents for breakfast and lunch. It's included. Uh, we just absorb that cost. In Kingsport, Katherine Simpson, News Channel 11. Nonprofits also help fill the gap, providing lunch and dinner. Second Harvest Food Bank serves more than 4,000 kids meals on the weekend through their backpack program. 